discussing the importance of respect in friendship. I don't know if that, that ca captions it very well. Anyway, let me give you the, back, the background story. Uh, two friends, two ladies, um, they've been friends from childhood and uh, one of them got married and later on had a child. And after she had a child, uh, this was a story that broke on Twitter, you know, after one of them had a child, she went on and told the other lady, her friend, you know, a childhood friend, uh, okay, now that I'm married, I'm situated, I have a child, please don't call me by my name anymore. You have to refer to me by my oh, child's name. name. You know, oh, for instance, <laughs> if, my name, if my son's name is Junior, you now call me Mommy, Mommy Junior. Junior. <laughs> you know, you yeah, can't so call me. Mama Junior. You can't call me uh, Patience uh, anymore, yeah, you yeah. know. <laughs> what are really the rules of friendship, you know, when it comes to, uh, you know, one person Marriage. moving on in life and, and all of that? What's the rule of friendship? Now, who's to say that the one that got married has moved on along mm. in life? And Let me quote what she said. I quote, and she said, uh, at least, as I don't first you born now, I take that one, senior you, so no more. Are, are, are they living in this box? <laughs> no, 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 no. Do you know what? Um, I need, a, I need to bring. That's why we actually brought him mm -hmm. more, sir. Ah, yeah, because you know, <laughs> I don't know. No, in Nollywood, the issue yeah, of respect yeah, yeah. and all that. That's, that's a big job. Especially in the indigenous, when it comes to the Yoruba uh, movement yes. sector, we have we get to see that a lot. <laughs> tell us, so tell us about that, that person. I don't really know, mm -hmm. but to me, I'm married, mm -hmm. and I've, I i did not think. My friends called me by my name. Bosse, they call you Bosse, okay. Yes, are till now, okay I don't it? think there's any big deal in that. Mm. Yes, now. I'm so sorry. It's your name. I'm, absolutely, I mean, I'm from, I mean, I'm <laughs> She from doesn't even know what to say. Like, what to say. You know, I mean, I mean, I've, I've got mixed culture. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, I, I was raised, born and raised here, and mm -hmm. I, live, I live in the UK. Mm -hmm. And we don't have this problem. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. we don't have this it's problem. It's a local Nigerian problem. Yeah, yeah, it's a Nigerian problem. Even Nollywood problem. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, it's okay. funny, because Nollywood is like the microcosm. That's our hero <laughs> in this part of the world. So, but it makes, granted. Okay. Kali wants to say something. Oh, okay. Go ahead. You know, I was actually doing like this. Yeah. <laughs> I was touching my head like, all right. <laughs> <laughs> no, say. No, you want me to call you and tell? No, just call you and tell. Call you, yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and that's it. And you, I will not you, just call you. No, but if your friend tells you that, what would you? What would you? That mm. <laughs> she's looking for trouble. Mm. Uh -huh. She wants me to call her by her son's name. Mm. Mm. I will look for a very bad name to call her. Naya Mosura. When her son's name is not Mosura, all that. Mm. Mm. His name is yeah. not Mosura. <laughs> no, because that I don't think that will ever happen to me. I will not give that chance for such that to happen so because stupid, I didn't no. do it. You get uh, oh, the only experience I had, maybe it's different from this, is um, a friend I kept in my house for like four years, and later she got money, small money running around. And I say, Don't call me by my mommy. name, call me mommy. You say, I say, It's still the same thing. Do you smoke air as breakfast? I, say, I don't get it. Mommy, you say, Okay, wait for me. <laughs> <I'm coming." laughs> so she wasn't married, mm. so it was two different. Um, mm. Okay, she wasn't married. But it's, it's still respect. It's still it's so she wanted me to Not exactly. I think we need to define what exactly respect is yes. in relation to friendship. In Nigeria, respect is everything. When I drop my food, don't put hand. You have to respect me. Oh, when I do yeah. this, don't do uh, this. Guess, or do we say courtesy? <laughs> no, 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 no. In, in the normal setting, the way it is, because I just love being real, the main thing is, so people believe that once they have money mm -hmm. than another person, mm -hmm. once you're able to give the person either food, shelter, there should be this respect. They have something you don't say, eh, I'll be a person. <laughs> or I'll be, there is a way that you still want to give that person I, that I respect. I don't even think it's respect. So, I don't, so like, I was going to tweet about this. I got in this morning and mm -hmm. you know how they say when you're in Rome, you, you behave like mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And I found myself saying, ah, good afternoon, good morning, sir. And I'm like, this is not me. You know what I mean? Like, this is, just, <laughs> I'm going to do it anyway. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? But I don't think it's to do with, no, I think it's just, I don't think it's to do with money. But I think it's just a, it's a culture oh, so, that we bring yeah. here um, yeah. that people just expect. No, 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 no. It's not the cultural aspect, aspect of it person. because you guys are friends on the same level. Exactly. And once one person, childhood steps, friends, steps, childhood friends, steps, 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 ste
Yeah. Some of them just stop talking to you. Childhood friends. They I don't stop talking to you. They still have the new friends. Where they really friends they in the first place. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Where they really friends. Where they really friends. Well, I have a friend. You know, he just. Alera, please, from now on, don't call me by my name. Call me by. Mommy Rocky Bat. Oh, oh no. okay. Yes. Yeah, we're starting that now. Oh, I'm going to have to insult her. See, see, yes, now. Yeah. If she's not married, definitely I'm saying, ah, you are not married. So let me just, just call me by my daughter's name. Everyone is trying to be young and keep it. No, 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 Mm. Yeah, I think it's a mindset. Yeah. <laughs> it's a mindset like that <laughs> calling saying. you by the name of your child it's, it's, to well, me. Well, it actually yeah, plays out in the, like I say, in our environment. I really don't want to use the local area or whatever it is. In our environment, it actually plays out there in the marketplace. And because they have this mindset that once you have a child, you don't mm. have to call the person by the person's name again. Mm. You have to call the person Iya. <laughs> Something. So even Something. even with their husbands, that even gone down to their husbands. Yeah, they don't call you. Normally, you call my husband by name. That's a different conversation. You call him by name. No, that's bad. That's bad. Mommy, 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 momm
yes, and mm-hmm. other things. Yeah, no, but, but there's nothing I, wrong. I, I, there's not never, one thing to. She to. No, 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 no. She actually said if the two people, it's okay. not that wasn't like a recommendation I mean, it's, it's a good for every married but, couple. Know, but in practical things, <clears throat> right now, mm-hmm. let's face reality. A lot of ladies wouldn't want to have a joint. Of Even that. the men too. Can I, can I just say? I can tell you a story. <laughs> the men want it. The men want it. But we don't. No, the women, the we men don't. don't. Want it. No. no, no. My okay. dad told me a story that will okay. make everyone laugh. All right. Uh, when the moon comes out, we we'll listen to that story. Oh no. <laughs> All right. So many reactions here, yeah, and the time is fast moving on. Uh, this guy, he says his name is Richie from Dubai. He says uh, that he would divorce that wife and he will make sure that he suffers her like mad before divorcing her. And he believes the woman should go and start a better life with someone else. I don't know what he means by it. No, no, what exactly? Right, let me just go. Let me just go from Dubai. Let me just go through Please, the just, feedback. Yeah, okay. Give us his All right, this, this <laughs> other one, uh, Cynthia says, wealth has nothing to do with respect uh, for one's spouse. The I basic agree. is love, trust, oh. communication, and understanding. Mm-hmm. The man needs help of a psychologist. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, on the issue of friendship and respect, uh, Ifunaya from Alagbado says, well, I would take that to be a joke, but if it's not, <laughs> it is a joke. <laughs> but if it's not, then that's, that's that for the mm-hmm. friendship because it's not even courtesy. It's left for me to accord her the marriage respect. Mm-hmm. You shouldn't beg for it, for you know. Okay, so many uh, reactions. All right, we need to take a very quick break and then come back and look at the last issue. Uh, but on that break, we're bringing you a funny, a funny moment video, a funny social media uh, video. <laughs> you know when you go to the party and then you've, you've had so much to drink? <laughs> One of those moments. Yes, mm-hmm. and then those kind of dance steps uh, you, you do in, in private. I always drive my friends back <laughs> to the party so you I know, never yeah. drink. So you never drink. <laughs> wow. You know, like all those dance steps uh, you never do in public, you know, that's when they come out. And then I, know, I think that's what happened to this lady. Uh, let's check it out. Oh, we'll no. It's, it's go- I hope it's not disrespectful to women. Well, it's not. We'll come back. <laughs> what you drink when you go to parties you know because you never know you might just end up on social media That's and you'll be on national tv uh, okay all right so back to the show yes uh, our last topic today is trust in relationship i'll give you the backstory. a lady on facebook reportedly said she has the intention of setting her husband up with her best friend so that she could determine if her husband was truly committed and faithful to the marriage. So, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> is it proper, <laughs> is it right, you know, for you to actually, you know, do that to your spouse, be it the lady or the, or the man, you know, to determine whether or not you can trust who you're with? I know a true life story. Yeah. Today, the man and the supposed friend are happy married. Okay, married. because of married. something like this. Yeah. Yes. Mm. And it will only end up saying, um, "Is a man's word." You gave me meat, so why won't I eat it? Mm. Yes. So you give him meat. I can't you, do you it. You know what you're doing, no, 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 and you no, no, give no. him piece of 
expression it's weird mm. so watch another movie so just sit it's down. neither here mm. nor there you know I it's a really dicey know. situation i think it's neither here why i'm no, i'm too busy for that trash no mm. I, would, I don't even have the time to be trying to you know but i don't think it's neither why are you doing that do you know what i mean you that's my point like she does the outcome same. Yeah. I, I feel what she does if the they same. fall in love mm -hmm. yeah, out exactly. of the game mm. And you then, are out of the game. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. They always oh, can't do it all. Of that. But we, we have to keep in mind that we have a lot of insecure women mm -hmm. out there. And men as well. And men as well. Men as well. Men as well. Yes. So, Joe, you were saying? I, I lost my chain of thought. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think, you know, the truth of the matter is, uh, you know, don't shoot me, guys, mm. um, is I always say, and I'm not condoning it, but I, in my, some way in my mind, I kind of say men. There's just something that's loose about them. So why? I have a gun right here. Why? Why set? Why give a dog a bone? Mm, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. I mean, like, temptation is is their middle name. So if anything, you should be helping him to stay away <laughs> from it. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. so Always I, protect I, them. Yeah, right. just you know mm -hmm. what I mean. And I think trying to set up my husband with my friend, I think it's just wrong. It's it just, is wrong. And my friend agreed to it. My friend, and my friend agreed to such. That means she's always had the intention. It's just wrong. She like, may not. You know the issues oh, of the yes. heart. Somehow is, things yeah. just happen. I think it's wrong. I, I agree with I, her a hundred percent. It shows a, a high level of someone who's really immature. Yeah. Yes. That's just the way I see it. Why would you? I wake would. sleeping dogs, mm -hmm. so to speak. Now that's not to say. I also know some guys that have been set up this way and they never fell. Mm. Now, this is the issue. When mm. the guy got to know mm -hmm. that it was a setup, set up. it broke the it relationship. Was, yeah. Not because he fell, but because he was angered. Like, at what the, in the world? You know. But then we need to help people out there who are insecure in marriages, in relationships. Of course, you hear it's the result of a lot of these domestic violence things mm -hmm. that we hear about and, and all. Alera and I were surfing the net and we saw <laughs> how a man broke the wall, you know, of his home just because the wife took the phone. She just, uh, she didn't look at anything. Oh, just because yeah. she took the you know, phone. so yes. something as little as a phone can cost somebody their lives, you know. So, but then what is a better way to, to determine if you could trust someone you're with? Rather than setting the person up. Can I just say something? Quickly, yes. Trust yes. is internal. Mm -hmm. It's not it doesn't come from outside, it comes from you. Now, granted, you need to meet someone who, you know, has the same wavelength or frequency with your trust. And the person has to it takes a while, it takes time and consistent behavior to build trust. Mm. Okay? But if you are not secure in yourself, no matter how straight your partner is, you, you will always have, have doubts. Have okay. So it's all back to what's going on Inside. in there. Bosse, what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> so me, I can't do that, mm -hmm. but I, I don't really, I don't even know. <laughs> but I can't, I can't set up my, I can set my husband, I can't set him up, sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, think, I don't even I know what to say. Crazy, it makes no sense. Yeah, it, it's, it's it's disrespectful. It is just echoing yeah, what, it's just echoing what yeah. you said. Yeah, just echoing what you said. I think being self-full is very, mm -hmm. very important. Mm -hmm. And I think, and that's why we say you just have to be too very busy. Because I think a lot of people are very high. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. You, you have, have to. You have that time. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. like, so I, I, I agree. Yeah. And a lot of men are not willing to as well just get it out of the woman to get busy. What, what would just so worried what about the man that is still planning? No, but but he helped her. It's just that he's after helping her, he wants to take it away from her. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Wow. If your husband is not, <clears throat> if your husband is not helping you, please help yourself. But that's what I'm saying. You yes, help yourself. Oh, you have to, you have to know how to be somebody yourself. Yes. Yeah. Because if you, when you, when you, when you value who you are, then your husband can value and yes. Yes. You know Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Our, our time is fast running. <laughs> I just got a very funny one here. This one says, "Good afternoon, ladies." Uh, if my wife get money past me, I'll be stealing her money inside her purse. Oh my lord. <laughs> you know, that's a that funny way of looking at oh, it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Rather than try to bring her, bring yeah. the money home, you know. Mm -hmm. um, okay, this other one says, uh, setting up your partner with your girlfriend is ab 
absolutely wrong. It might lead her to a regretful end. Mm -hmm. yes. uh, I think she needs to see a relationship or Excellent. marriage mm -hmm. uh, counselor. Cancel. I think that's true. All right, because our time is fast running. We have like two minutes left. Uh, Kali, last words before we go. Okay. The, the whole talk or the last one. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Just give us a, a last word. Okay. Um, be you. Be yourself. And once you're yourself, once you're you, you're, once you believe in yourself and you trust yourself, you'll be able to trust another person. Yes. Mm. Joe. So for me, I think it's important for you to have self-value. You, you need to be self-full, mm -hmm. selfish, self-full. Because self yes. then when you're full, you can then pour out mm -hmm. to the other person. So it's important for you to invest in yourself. And don't worry about the other person. Once you invest in yourself, then yeah, everything else will yeah. sort of They'll just out. get it. Absolutely. Yeah, they'll get it. Charles. Just be special. Yeah, be special. <laughs> Bosse, last word. Just be self-confident in your relationship. No. Trust who you're with. Yeah. You know, regardless. Yes. Trust. trust. Why are you with the person yeah. in the first place? I'm thinking yeah. yeah. myself with someone. I love the hard one. Just try. We have to go. Okay. <laughs> All right, it's been a super, super interesting Thursday. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, to all our guests. Bosse, Arou, Shegbe. Thanks to Charles Oyenoche. I thank you for coming and maybe Joke Maxwell. And also to Unkem Kaliobi. Mm. Thank you for coming through. <laughs> well, tomorrow at noon, do Sorry. hook up with us on the bars for yet another interesting edition of the show. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.